Brought to you by Eco Alkalines, environmentally responsible batteries, cat5.tv slash eco. So, you know what it's like when you want to impress your clients with an amazing presentation? You take your graphs, add some clip art, and spice the whole thing up with some fancy transitions. But somehow, it doesn't always have the desired effect. So one day, you come across one of those super cool promotional cartoons, and you think to yourself, wow, something like that would definitely catch my client's attention. But then you find out that it costs like a gazillion bucks to make. So you start scouring the web for a tool that can create extraordinary presentations for free. It's just that nothing out there is just quite the thing you're looking for. This tool just moves pictures around, and this one swivels so much you get seasick. And to operate this one, you have to be a rocket scientist. Wouldn't it be cool if there was a tool that allows you to create professional-looking animated presentations and cartoon-style videos just by dragging and dropping stuff onto a page? Well, now there is. Powtoon is a new tool that is so simple and intuitive, it allows anyone who ever used PowerPoint or Keynote to easily evolve their presentation to awesomeness. Powtoon contains themes of animated characters, props, and cool transitions, which you can just drag and drop onto your slide and create eye-catching and fun presentations that can be presented in person or turned into animated videos with the click of a button to be shared on YouTube, Facebook, or Twitter. Now your presentations will definitely keep your audience hooked. Powtoon brings awesomeness to your presentation. Created using Powtoon. So tonight we're actually going to take a look at that because, you know, the, the skeptic in me says, okay, it can't possibly be that easy and that awesome. So let's, mm -hmm. let's actually take a look. We're going to actually sign up for a free account right now okay. uh, at Powtoon. So this is powtoon.com, T-O-O-N, and you see the sign up for free button there. And you'll see that there are commercial uh, packages that you can get to remove advertising and things like that. But in order to get started, you don't need those. You can sign up for free. If you're an educator, click on this link right here, and this is going to give you access to, uh, to their educator package. And it's, uh, it's substantially cheaper, and it will help you to be able to use this stuff in, uh, in school, you know, if you want to show your students and things. So now let's sign up for a free account. Really, really quick, easy sign up process. Just enter my name. And uh, choose my username there. I'll just put in category five, use my email address. And easy breezy, throw in a password. Couldn't get much easier than this. Who am I? What do I do? I want to go with like professor. We'll just go other because. TV show host isn't in there. Well, it's sad. I know. <laughs> so let's go for it. All right, there we go. It sent me an email. So let's uh, just check what it says. There we go. All I got to do is click there to activate. So let's see what there is to it. Brilliant. <laughs> See, for some reason, it has frozen up my, my video there, playback, but I am in and activated. Let's take a look. There we go. So the first thing that I see is this screen that is my playground. So now anytime I go to Powtoon, now that I'm logged in, it loads up my playground. Give it a try. Cool. Check it out. Once I've clicked on start, I can choose either presentation mode, which is to create you know, a slideshow where I have to actually advance the slides, mm -hmm. or I can select movie mode. So it's going to and create something go that it's going to, yeah, you're going to set the timer on each slide and then it's going to proceed to the next timer. So because of the nature of what we do, I'm going to go with movie mode and let's give it a name. We'll call this. Um, so what we're going to actually do tonight, we're going to pretend that we're a computer shop. I think it'd be fun to pretend that we're creating an ad to put up on YouTube for our little computer shop out here in Barrie. So All we're going right. to actually take that concept and put together some kind of a, a spot here. So we're going to call this My Computer Shop Ad Number One. Check out My Computer Shop. Okay, now we're going to just go with no thanks. Let's just create. We're not going to use a, a predefined style. 
And now let's open that up. I'm going to go edit. And now this is the Powtoon interface. Well, it's right up in your web browser. So I'm just using Chrome here, Google Chrome. And there we have our starting template. So the first thing that I like to do down over on the bottom right here, now I'm going to, uh, I'm just going to reload my cursor so that you can actually see my mouse cursor here. There we go. You should be able to see that now on the screen. Okay, so down here on the bottom right, there is an option to change your background. So first thing I want to do is just click on one of those and I can set that up however I like. So now up here we've got our characters, our text, anything that we want to put in. We're starting with our first slide. You'll see on the left hand side here, we're on our first slide, there is only one. And we're going to grab a really frustrated looking guy and just drop it onto <laughs> our canvas. Resize it however I like. Let's add some text, say. Frustrated with your computer. We can resize that just like you would expect. Change the text up here, change the color. It's very easy Weiss a wig. What you see is what you get kind of editing. Grab a prop here. Let's throw a nice little laptop computer in there that he can be getting frustrated over. And you see that all this stuff is coming in absolutely free for me to be able to use this stuff uh, because I'm going to be exporting and it's going to have their little ad at the, at the end there created with Powtoon. You see a computer there? I know there are some. I don't. There's, I saw there, a camera. There we go. Okay. So I've, I've laid a laptop in here. So that's the computer that he's frustrated with. But it's facing the wrong way. So I'm going to hold in my right-click button, and I'm going to go flip. Now it's facing the correct direction. Fancy. Yeah. So <laughs> now let's work on, so we want to actually create transitions, mm -hmm. make it so that things kind of pop in, and they right. don't just all of a sudden appear on the canvas. So I've highlighted frustrated with your computer, and I'm going to click on this little icon right there, which means it's going to fade in. I'm going to change that to pop in. Okay, and I'm going to change it to pop out. Now this man here, I'm going to click on him, and I'm going to click on him, I'm going to use a hand. So I'm going to turn on hand, and I'm going to go left. So a hand is actually going to come in and move <laughs> him from the right-hand side to the left-hand side. Then we're going to do the same on the right, so that this is the way that it ends. We're going to use that hand effect again. I'm going to drag the timeline just a little bit, because you saw what was happening there is that he was extending beyond the end, so there was no yeah. transition effect. So, so far, if I push play, that's what I have so far. Oh, that's pretty okay. neat. Pretty neat. Yeah. <laughs> cool, eh? So, what I want to do is I, I want to stop that laptop from popping in. I want it to look like okay. it's coming in with him. So, we're going to change that to move left. We're not going to use a hand because that would create a second hand. So, now, if the timing is correct which it's not, it starts too late. So now what we're going to do is we're going to click on that laptop. We're going to start it earlier in this really easy to use timeline. Let's see that. There we go. That's quite a bit better. So the slide is long. You know, so if we we're going to voice this, we'd be frustrated with your computer. So what we can do is over here on the right hand side, I'm going to push the minus button and we're going to shrink things down to about five seconds long. So now again, I've broken my transition. So I'm just going to shrink those a little bit the right hand side of each item that uh, each element there we go so now it looks like this oh <laughs> did something weird there with my laptop let's see we'll fix that okay so the timing is a bit better let's fix the laptop so hmm What did you do? What did I do? Mm. I, apparently I broke the laptop. This easy peasy. It's not that method. hard. Well, it's just you. It's you that's broken. I know. I, know. <laughs> I did. I literally <laughs> broke the laptop. <laughs> I don't understand when in how doubt, you got it to go over there. It's so easy to use though. I mean, I can I can easily highlight and delete and drag and drop and right click and flip and, you know, it's Easy breezy. It's Let's very, see if that... very ironic to the situation. It's a laptop that's causing you pain. Yeah. There. Okay. Beautiful. Whatever. 
<laughs> <laughs> Did you see where I, I don't know if it's if it matters, but it is in beta. There there could be an occasional little glitch, but that could have also been very much me. But there we go. Okay, so there's our first slide. Frustrated with your computer? Phew, get him out of there. All right. <laughs> now up here we're gonna create our next slide. Nice and easy. So grab a happier looking dude. There we go. He's happy. Scale that in. Oh, we have a great hairstyle. Love the hair. That's I know nice. guys with that hair. <laughs> and see, all I'm doing is I'm grabbing props, I'm grabbing characters, grabbing words. Mm -hmm. This particular word one I've, I've gotten has got a kind of a, a scaling effect, right. kind of flying in effect. So now if I edit this. Oh, it's oh, neat that it actually gosh. shows you yeah, it's got right nice in the box preview. here um, exactly what you're going to be seeing. And let's, we'll just leave that as black text. Looks good. Call us. Let's make it big. So now for this slide, so far. Boom. Just like that. So we want to give our con contact information, our company information. some kind of tagline. So we're a computer shop now, right? There we go. Shorten this slide down again. There we go. See how easy it is to manipulate, though, eh? Um, I'm just kind of watching in awe right now. I just just to be able to like drag and drop it's things. It's so and simple. Why was it never this simple mm -hmm. to create these kind of amazing presentations? It's always you know with using PowerPoint and using a PowerPoint equivalent software. Mm -hmm. It's really really difficult. This is not. I mean, so I'm going to do the hand effect again this time. I'm going to go up. Now I'm going to use the hand again by checking it so that it's no longer crossed off, and then go down. So now when I run this slide. There's the hand, moves it in. We'll fix your system fast, call us. And then, next slide, let's have our guy, we can pick any one of these. Um, I'd like to have one where he's actually, hopefully there's one where he's sitting at a computer. There's a guy kind of reclining. Oh yeah, laying on his side, <laughs> playing guitar. Oh, look at that, there's one where they're sitting on a laptop. Perfect. So. We'll and you can see you can go through and, and just pick something that, that suits you. And there are many, many mm -hmm. different styles up here, which we'll very quickly glance at as well. So grab our text. We'll say serving berry and area. We'll just throw that up here. And here we're very, very close to having a presentation that you might pay two, three thousand dollars to have produced, mm -hmm. and it's ready to go out of the box. So, five, 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 five. five. www. dot our website mm -hmm. is awesome. One, two, three. dot com. His email address wow. unfortunately <laughs> wraps to the other to the second line of the. Uh, <laughs> it's one of those addresses. It's one of those. Yeah. Yeah, I just figured I gotta think of something that's probably not out there because people are gonna click on it. <laughs> okay, there we go. And if that worked out, really, really quickly, serving the berry and area brings in the phone number. He knows how I brought the hand in there. There we go. Oh, takes it okay. away. Yeah. Cool. And then we can fade everything out. Just by manipulating the timeline here so that see what happens there. There's enough time now to 10 seconds that it can fade out. So now if I press play. There we go. Excellent. So now using your microphone, mm -hmm. you're, you're going to record an overdub. So you'll press play all up at the top left. And you'll be able to record yourself saying your script. So be cool. prepared. And then... All you're going to do is just click on the import button up here, and that's actually going to import the right. audio file. So save as an MP3, and you're going to be able to
place your audio file on the timeline. It's going to automatically start at the beginning and play all the way through. So time it with your, with your slides. So let's press play all and see how this turned out. Are you frustrated with your computer? We're going to fix your system fast. Call us today. Serving Barrie and the surrounding areas. Visit our website is awesome123.com or call 555555555. And that's all there stutter. is to it. Yeah. <laughs> save your work. Always save your work. There it is. Right up at the top. Here's where things get really fun. Really exciting. If that wasn't Can't enough wait. for you. Check this out. Share. Export to YouTube directly. Mm. Or save an HD video file. Wow. Remember, we're in movie mode. So, oh, and I've got zoom on here. Not sure if I can get out of it. There we go. So I can actually say with a free account, I get 10 free exports. It's going to come with branding, so that means it's going to have mm -hmm. their logo on it. But again, you can subscribe to a, 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 an affordable account if you decide that, hey, this is something I'm going to actually use professionally. Right, right. right. If you're going to be using it for your company, you can choose to do that. And you might, you might. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's, it's super cool, um, but to be able to do it for free means that you as, as a home user or perhaps a student, um, uh, even a teacher, if you want to just give it a try, uh, but then do check out, you know, there are special packages specifically right. for, for each level of, of user. But I think that's really, really cool. It's called Powtoon, spelled P-O-W-T-O-O-N dot com. Check it out. Uh, tell them that Category 5 sent you and uh, just uh, give that a go. I mean, to be able to throw those together so quickly. Right. That was actually really quick for... We just produced off the I mean, fly a, a 15, 20-second <laughs> commercial and took, you know, what, about 10 minutes with mm -hmm. explaining everything and, and showing you how it's done. Really, really simple. I told you I would show you, so I will just really, really briefly show you. And I want you to play around with this. Give it a try. But you'll see up here that you can actually choose different styles. So if I wanted to use this guy, for example... I've got these other kinds of characters as well that I can use. Uh, we've got these kinds of things. You know, those kinds of tags like that, and you can bring them in with the hand again, and it looks really cool. Uh, and there's even, you know, technical theme where you can throw in things that look very, very technical. Fly those in, pop them in, add sound effects, whatever you want to do. So there's really no end to what you can do. I mean, be creative with mm -hmm. it. It's really, really easy to use. And uh, I'd recommend you check it out. Very cool. We're using it on Linux today through uh, Google Chrome. It is a Flash program. So you can see that uh, it, uh, it's running on my system under Flash 11.5. So give it a try. Powtoon.com. Very cool. I'm like impressed. That? Impressed. Hmm. No pun intended. <laughs> Category 5 TV is a production of Prodigy Digital Solutions and is licensed under Creative Commons Attribution 2.5 Canada. Thanks for watching.